Good morning. It's another rainy morning. We are headed to the Magic Kingdom today. Good morning. We are just leaving the room. It is, what time is it? 8.30. 8.30. You <laughs> just said it two seconds ago. And I forgot. Anyway, we had a uh, little bit better of a night last night. I think we're somewhat rested, although I think I woke up with Brayden's cold today. We haven't eaten, haven't had coffee. You have it in hand though. Breakfast of champions. Coffee? We had muffins, but we were like, screw it. We're not done. We need to get there for <laughs> we, a It's hard to like manage two kids and eat and drink, so we were like, forget it. We have breakfast reservations this morning at 10.30 though, or 10.15 at Crystal Palace. And we were able to get a virtual queue for Tron today, which we are very excited about. So hopefully that'll be okay on an empty stomach. <laughs> but <laughs> not a good idea. Anyway, we're just trying to power through here. It is, uh, it's also rainy this morning, so hopefully that turns around quickly. Thought I'd show you a look this morning at the kids' kind of splash play area in the pool while nobody's in it, and the resort is very nice here. Let's go see the pool. It's a little hot tub area over here. They even have like a handicap accessible lift and Little river runs on this side. And then here's the main pool with the little slide. I think we're gonna try and see if Braden can go down that slide later, but I don't know. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. And to get out to, oh, there's a squirrel friend over here. Hello. Oh God, no, no. he's gonna attack me. <laughs> to get out to the boats, you just follow it along the boardwalk and head out to the boat ramp to get to the parks, or get to Magic Kingdom, I should say. Just over here is where the boat launches. So I'm just walking along here and there's like some noises of animals. I'm pretty sure they pipe noises through uh, to act, sound like you're on an actual marsh. I mean, it is kind of a legit marsh, but you no. Know, the add, added sounds. All right, we're gonna wait for the boat and head to the Magic Kingdom. We made it into the Magic Kingdom! First time of the trip. I always feel like I'm never at Disney until like I go to Magic Kingdom for some reason. I don't know. But we're here, all the fall decorations are up, and I think we're headed straight to Tron this morning because our lightning lane started at 8.45, or sorry, our virtual queue started at 8.45, and we have to be there by 9.45. So, we are headed to Tron. Rob just went on Tron, and now it is my turn. He got row one again. Lucky. What I get. There's all the lockers, but we're skipping through. So excited! Here we go. We just got off Tron and it was awesome, but short. I understand what everybody means now. That like initial launch is so fast. I think that was my favorite part for sure. I agree. It's definitely a lot faster than I thought it was going to be. Yeah. Slightly too short. It's like maybe another like 30 seconds would have been like a perfect. Yes. Just yeah, a little bit too short, but. We walked right on because we got the virtual view, so that was nice. We didn't really have to wait. So you can't complain when you walk on, right? It was not bad. The buzz? You see Buzz Lightyear? <laughs> We're gonna go on the buzz ride. Answer! Good job, Buzz! Good job! We did it! Yay! Well, we accomplished Buzz. It was basically a uh, walk on which was nice it was about literally less than said 10 minutes but we basically walked on and now we are headed over to crystal palace to have breakfast with winnie the pooh and friends so we're hoping the kids are really gonna like this one Amelia is falling asleep. <laughs> Poor little girl. Peek-a-boo! 
It's so nice. <laughs> Thank you, Tigger. Hi, Eeyore. <laughs> so I quickly show you what we got here. We have a churro Mickey waffle, which is special to the Crystal Palace. I got a frittata, some cheesy eggs, some blueberry pancakes, and some bacon. And we have juice. Brayden's not eating, he's just interested in characters. Uh... Oh my goodness. <laughs> Just finished our breakfast at Crystal Palace and <laughs> the kids loved it. They uh, really enjoyed the character interactions, especially Amelia was sleeping for the first little bit, but then she woke up and she loved it. So overall, I think it was good. What did you think? Yeah, it was good. We uh, pro tip, you come right, uh, right in the junction between breakfast and lunch and you can have brunch. So we got to sample both venues, which was excellent. We did, yeah. We came yeah. around, I think our reservation was at 10.15, so we had breakfast and a little bit of lunch. So it yeah. worked out really well. The characters came around. We saw it, we, a couple of them twice, yeah. and at least every character yeah, once. They were really good. So. They stopped, and they were, they were at least at like, the table for a couple of minutes, so it was good. Yeah they, yeah. Would, yeah, they didn't just like quickly come by, but anyway, it was really good. We enjoyed it. The kids really liked it. I'm glad. We did it because I think they're at the, a really good age for it anyway. So now we are headed to Jungle Cruise because we have a lightning lane. Sony and butterflies, now their wingspan is extremely impressive. Can go anywhere from 12 inches to a whopping one foot. Mickey to sign your book. Thank you, Mickey. Wow, you please start with Mickey. I can Thank you, Mickey. Thank you, friends. Okay, you want a picture? We are back at the Magic Kingdom now. It's been a uh, it's been a few hours to say the least. We uh, went back to the room, tried to have a nap. Brayden was like coughing. He's sick. He just would not fall asleep because he was coughing every time he laid down. Amelia napped for about an hour. Got up and uh, we tried to go to the pool. It was bucketing rain. Thunderstorms. <laughs> Thunderstorms. Yeah. Close the pool. We sat there for an hour and then. They still didn't reopen, so 
We went back to the room. Poor Amelia has a fever. I'm pretty sure she caught what Brayden has, which, you know, if you have kids, there's pretty much no avoiding. If one kid's sick, the other one's gonna get it, so. By the time we got changed, we came back down to go back to Magic Kingdom, which was like 20 minutes, the storm stopped. So we could've gone swimming, but you know, that's anyway. the way of the world these days. Here we are. So we are uh, back at the Magic Kingdom for a couple hours. We probably won't stay long just because we know Amelia's not feeling too good, but it's not quite bedtime yet. So we're gonna try Brayden on the Barnstormer right now. He's never gone on a roller coaster. We think it's like the only one he can go on because he's not quite, he's just over 37 inches, which is not tall enough for the rest. So we're gonna attempt to do the uh, Barnstormer and see how he does. I don't think it's gonna go very good. doing are we gonna ride the barnstormer yeah is this a fun plane okay we got front row here we go Whee! okay make sure we're gonna hold on okay going up look Braden ready Ready, 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 put your arms up. Second time's a charm. We are so good we had to do it twice. Yay! How was it? Good? Yay! Yay. And Mr. Smee! Okay, Brayden's going on the ride to horsey, so we're coming on the horsey.
We are on a Disney world. You like this ride? <laughs> we went on Haunted Mansion. It was scary, so we had to come on this ride. got off it's a small world and it was a huge hit with the kids especially Amelia she loved it and Brayden loved it when he was that age so now Brayden's at the age where he wants to touch the water now he's yes just wants to stick his hand out of the boat and touch the water but we ended up getting a lightning lane for Big Thunder Mountain so we are gonna head that way now and we're gonna do the uh, child swap situation and uh, yeah, we're going to check out the progress, too, on uh, the new Tiana's Bayou Venture, I think it's called, that was the old Splash Mountain. So, see if we uh, see any progress. So we haven't updated in a while, <laughs> but we got the cheeseburger spring rolls and we've never tried them. So we're going to try them now. Long time coming. No pressure. It's pretty spot on. It tastes like a cheeseburger and a spring roll. <laughs> Specifically a McDonald's cheeseburger. That's what I've heard, yeah. I've... I think maybe it's the sauce. It kind of tastes like, like mac sauce maybe. Yeah. Know. So is it good? It's good. But is it, expensive. Is it worth $12? Probably, or $9? Probably not. No, probably not. We required a blonde. Dessert. That's our dinner for tonight. Brayden has a cookie currently. It's just that kind of night. Oh, we, well, we just had the cheeseburger. Spring rolls. It's probably loud, so you can't even hear us. But we're it's almost 9 o'clock. We're going to watch the fireworks. We're all posted up for the fireworks. We've got 10 minutes to go. Amelia's out. She's passed out. <laughs> Brayden's on his last draw. So, so you know, we're hanging good. in there. We're hanging in there trying to hit the fireworks tonight. <laughs> so anyways, we're going to have our dessert and watch the fireworks. Every show. 